hey guys welcome back to my channel today we're going to be doing something new i'm actually going to show you guys how i installed this beautiful wig from victoria's wigs so let's get started first i want to say how cute the packaging is so first things first there's the wig um they also send you a bunch of little goodies uh, for your convenience they send you a little brochure about hair care and their company and different things like that and then they also go ahead and send you another little baggie that has everything in it um so it has a edge brush a comb it has two different colored um wig caps and it also comes with tweezers and a little makeup brush so i just love that i thought that was so cute Now my first impression um, while taking the wig out, I thought that it was beautiful. Like it was really shiny. It felt really soft. Um, this is an HD uh, five by five wig and it is pre-plucked. Um, so it's really very beginner friendly, honestly. It comes with combs, it comes with elastic band. You don't have to add any of that stuff. Um, so this, I would recommend this for any beginner who needs help or um, is, you know, is just starting out with wigs. I really do feel like, like this would be the wig for you. Like look, look at how that lace is. Look how thin and nice that lace looks. Like, oh my gosh, like, oh, anyways, let's get started. So. First, I went ahead and bleached my knot. So here, you, you know, you guys know the deal. I'm not going to do too much talking, but I'm just going to go ahead and mix my developer and my bleach. I'm going to go ahead and bleach those knots. And I'm going to wash it in some purple shampoo so I can go ahead and tone those knots. So I let the bleach sit for about 20 to 30 minutes and look look how nicely the knots took to the bleach like you could already see that they're pretty blonde so I'm just gonna go ahead and wash this out I'm gonna shampoo with purple conditioner and I'm gonna go ahead and deep condition off of camera just so I could you know put the moisture back into the roots Now, before I do go ahead and put the wig on, I did want to go ahead and do just a little bit of plucking. So that's what I went ahead and did. I did a little bit of plucking and I went ahead and laid the top of the wig down with my curling iron just so I could, would ha wouldn't have to do so much um, once I actually put the wig on.
I thought I went ahead and plucked it a little bit and laid it a little bit down. I didn't want to see how the wig looked on me. Um, and oh my gosh, the hair was so pretty. Now, I do want to say I did go ahead and dye the wig jet black off of camera. And even though the wig was already 200 density, I did go ahead and buy a bundle from my local beauty supply store and add one more bundle onto the hair because I, I like my hair really big. Now, by all means, you don't have to do this because the wig is thick. I'm just extra, so I went ahead and added an extra bundle. But you don't have to, honey. The wig, the hair is already super beautiful. Um, and now I'm just laying the wig down. So I'm going to stop talking now. I'm going to let y'all watch. Here, I'm just laying my baby hairs now with some Nairobi foam. Um, and guys, let me be honest with you. I was really scared when I was taking, when I was unwrapping my hair um, after my baby hairs were dried. Because, honey, I don't usually glue my wigs down, but I was going on vacation and I did not want that wig to slip up at all or anything. So, this was really my first time actually gluing a lace down to my forehead. And, honey, I was scared. But it came out beautiful, so, yeah. Now, all I did here was add a little bit of that Nairobi foam to the ends of my hair just to kind of give the ends a little bit of definition. Um, I didn't really add too much product to this hair because it was so beautiful. All I really did was add a little bit of foam and a little bit of hair oil. And honey, this wig was ready to go. Child, this is me being scared to take this wig, to take this band off because remember, this is my first time gluing a wig down. I didn't know what to expect. But honey, when you look at that, do you see what lace, honey? What lace? Yes, Victoria's wig. What lace? Because that thing was flawless, honey. It was flawless. Y'all see that? Mm. Now, all I'm doing is combing out my baby hairs just so they can look a little bit softer. And that's it, guys. This wig was so easy to go ahead and put on. I really recommend this wig. I'll leave all the details below. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time.